What's poppin' squad? It's your boy Thompson, and I'm back with another mukbang. Today, I am trying pyology. You guys ever heard of that? You got a pyology in your hood? Well, if you don't, I'm about to give you a review. And if you ha do have one and you've never been there, let your boy tell you how it is and give you my experience. Before I do, hit that subscribe button, tap that notification bell so you don't miss out on any videos. Let's get it, y'all. I'm hungry than a mother. So, on this pizza, all right, let me give you a little spiel about Pyology Pizza. You go in there, you kind of you create the pizza yourself. They do have some that's already created, and you can just order that way. But so today, I created two of them things because I'm hungry than a mother, like I said. So, on this one, it's thin crust, and I put added pepperoni, Italian sausage mozzarella cheese with light tomato sauce thin crust on the second one i got cauliflower crust chicken bacon and olives with pesto sauce oh shit that one sound bomb <laughs> you know i know how to create shit you feel me and you got some ranch let's get into it y'all shit i ain't playing I'm hungry in the motherfucker I would lift it up, but I'm working with a lot. But that's with that Italian sausage. The sausage is hella big chunks and pepperoni. Oh, and it has basil on it too. And the other one has um, parsley. Oh, that's not bad. Not bad at all. Mm-hmm. Damn, crush is bad. The pepperoni is bad. So you know when you go in there and create your own pie. It's like Subway style. You know how you start, well, this place starts with the veggies first, then your meats, or sauce, veggies, meats, and cheese, and you're done with it. That's some fat pieces of pepperoni though, huh? And that's the Italian sausage, pretty big. It's good though. <laughs> but what's poppin', squad? How y'all doing? You straight? You straight? You you over there straight? I'm cool. Let's get in this cauliflower crust though pizza with the chicken and bacon damn she didn't cut this one that good damn i hope you losing points biology that's what that bad boy look like you see it you can smell it just smell it you can have a bite too because this one's gonna be bomb take a bite Okay. Mm hmm. I want to sum with this one. Mm. Pesto sauce, bam. Chicken, bam. Bacon, bam. Cauliflower crust, fire. Mm hmm. It's my healthy pizza. Shut the hell up. I'm my own eating healthy shit, man. Oh, what the fuck I be doing? <laughs> That's fire. It would be so much better if it was cut up properly.
It's all good though. We ain't gonna sweat the small stuff. You know what I mean? Ain't too much shit going on in the world. <laughs> it's crazy. See that Italian sauce? I mean sausage. It's fat, huh? Uh oh, dripping. That's what she said. <laughs> I hope all you guys are well and safe and dodging the Rona and the variant. This is crazy. I'm so sick of this stuff. Sick of it. We ain't going back to normal in a minute. So... <laughs> Let me just put it out there. <clears throat> the cauliflower crust? I mean, not bad. Bottom of it. This definitely have a more healthier taste, but I know some of you are gonna be jaw jacking because it has chicken and bacon on it. <clears throat> like, how are you gonna try to be vegan and you eating chicken and bacon? I didn't say I was gonna be vegan today. I'm getting it out of my system. <laughs> and when I really turn vegan shit, you know I'm gonna have me a fat ass steak. I mean, boy, big as your motherfucking bat. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? I think I'm bullshitting. I ain't playing. I'm a real talk. I wanna see if I can do it. I can convert over without any difficulties. Y'all think I could do it? Think your boy could do it? And for all you other mofos out there who be saying, oh, Nick, man, you don't never have nothing to drink when you eat. Guess what that is? I give you a dollar. Did you guess what it is? You ain't guess what it is, my lady. Woo! Mm-hmm. Nick, you don't never drink nothing when you eat. You know, let me tell you the reason why. But I do, though. Just off camera. But the reason you don't really see me drink anything... Is because I'm the type of person, if I drink something or get something to drink and I get it before I eat, I tend to drink a lot to the point I get full and I lose my appetite. So, is that bug on the inside of my shit? I don't know. It's on the outside. I was about to say. I'm gonna start flying out now because the food's smelling good. Look at that. Nigga, did you know that I can see you? So, what's popping off? Um, just got my car back like last week. <laughs> That was the reason why I wasn't uploading when I wanted to and have my whip. 
And let me just say this. Lyft and Uber, y'all motherfuckers need to get your shit together because you mofos is taxing, okay? You're charging too much for your services. Is outrageous. And don't even let me get on your peak hours prices. Mm, mm, mm. I you expect someone to pay $40 for a trip that's normally like $15. A trip that's normally eight, nine dollars is $22. That shit ridiculous. And I'm not even talking about peak hours. We don't even want to get into that price. It's normal hours. I was like, oh my God. I need my wet back ASAP. But, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. First, we gotta get to work and stuff. What can you do? Cause the last thing I'm gonna do is call you motherfuckers and ask for a ride or something. I ain't even gonna deal with all that bullshit. Now don't get it twisted. There's some, there's some, there's some real ones out there that'll hook your boy up. Real talk. But then there's some others who say they got your boys back. But if you ask for something like that, a ride. And be like, oh man, you know, I can't do it. You know what I mean? I got woo woo. No, oh, I feel it. That's cool. I don't ask like to ask people for shit. Less things to worry about. Motherfucker help you out and they gotta go tell everybody. You know what I mean, man? I mean the car broke down, man. I got that brother ride a few times this week. You know what I mean? Nigga was interfering in my day in my business. Why like, motherfucker fuck yeah. <laughs> That's real talk, but y'all know what I'm talking about. Y'all know there's cats out there who you know that are like that. And I know some of them. Shit, yeah, a lot. But there are a few. A few of them now out of those. Help me out. I'll be right there, front line and center. I love that shit. Cause I'll do it for anybody too if I rock with you. And I have many times. But you know, I just the type of thing I am. Did you guess what it is yet? Just look at that. Look at that. Look, 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 look. my eyes were bigger than my stomach. I told you I was hungry than a movie. And I got two pizzas. Two pizzas. One Thompson. Thought I was going to be able to defeat them both. But <laughs> looks like they might have won for now. But the pizza is good. It's decent. Hmm. Bit my motherfucking lip. I hate when I do that. That should be hurt. And I was told when you bite your lip, it's because you're chewing too fast. Is that true? I don't think I know any other way than to chew fast. <laughs> Shit. I can't go be one of my fucking be like. <laughs> I ain't gone, my man. You know, are you really? It is what it is. But the fight crush is fire. It really is. 
I'm about full though. Dang. Woo! I got a little stomach, you know what I mean? Not sure in hella big. I could I could pack some stuff in there, but I guess two pizzas I can't. <laughs> and they're not that big of pizzas, they're like mm, I would say mm -hmm, about eight or nine slices each. That's not that big, right? But uh, I'm full, yeah. Was, yeah, man. That was Pieology Pizzeria. And now for my review, you know how I do it. One out of five, five being the best fire bomb I recommend it anybody. I'm going to get out of four. Even though I created the pizza myself, dude. <laughs> I've given it a four because a uh, pesto pizza with the chicken and bacon, it could have had some, um, I wish I it was cut up more. You know what I mean? That would have helped the brother out a lot. And for the um, thin crust pizza with the uh, regular tomato sauce on it, it was good, but I wasn't expecting that Italian sausage to be so big. It was, it was big. You seen it. And along with the pepperonis that are also big too, it's like that's the only thing you can see on the pizza, and there's other stuff on there. But um, overall, yeah, man, I give it a four. Now, I do recommend this place if you haven't tried it, so you know, so you can get the experience yourself and try it out. But um, it's not bad. I would say it's a step up from like a Papa Murphy's, a step up from a Papa John's. You know what I mean? So, and they hit me for thirty dollars with the drink. So, like 15 a piece, uh, that's like a medium, medium size. So, two pizzas, it's not bad. Because round table, it hits you for like almost 40 for a large. And that's a, a King Arthur. So, yeah. It was cool, man. Thank you guys for tuning in. I appreciate it, man. Remember, if you like this video, hit it with a thumbs up. If you didn't like this video... Hit it with a thumbs down. It's all good. I'm not tripping. Remember, spread love and not hate. And always keep it G. And, man, you guys, just stay safe out here. You know, it's crazy times, man. Just do what you got to do to make it. And you try not to get sick. And if you did get sick, recover right. And just be responsible, man. Don't think this shit is gone and over with. Because it's not by a long shot. This shit's here to stay for a minute. So, you know, maneuver how you do. And just be cool, man. It's your boy, Thompson. Love y'all. See y'all in the next one. Peace.